Irony. Panicked Megan removed a Netflix six-part documentary to delete proof for Samantha's lawsuit. The Harkles have removed the Netflix documentary where they mocked the curtsy to the Queen from Archwell. Interesting that the Harkles have removed their six-part mockumentary off of the Archwell Productions website. They do know that Archwell is listed in the credits, don't they? They're not as proud of their love story as they've previously claimed, if they're trying to hide the fact that they produced it. And Archwell Audio lists nothing. Archetypes has disappeared, even though it's still available on Spotify. Guess Megan's not proud of that either. So according to their website, they've done nothing in the last four years. But Harry's Heart of Invictus, Netflix, must be so proud of their investment. A source close to an insider reported that it turns out Megan tried to delete the proof with Samantha's lawsuit, especially since Samantha's lawyer made the point in the defamation lawsuit that Harry and Megan were responsible for defaming Samantha, because as the producers they were responsible for every word that was said. Today, an expert also expressed again that this has to be Today, an expert also expressed again that this has to be about Samantha's lawsuit because her attorney was specifically alleging that the fact that they not only personally made defamatory statements on the docuseries, but that they were also producers, approving what's said greatly bolsters defamation claims. But the documentary is still on Netflix. If anything, many at Netflix would enjoy seeing Megan freak out. Sam's law team already have it before, but intentionally announcing they're looking for proven lies seems to have caused the Harkles and their supporters to start deleting and hiding a lot of stuff. This seems to indicate that they know what they've been doing and now want to try to hide their hands. Awareness of guilt can be used as well, to my extremely unskilled eye at least. Currently, Megan's attorneys are asking the suit to be dismissed, claiming it's baseless and without merit. In the suit, Samantha Markle claimed a half-sister made false and reckless statements that ruined her reputation and destroyed her peaceful life in Lakeland. She said that she's received death threats and faced scrutiny in the community. She points to Oprah Winfrey interview that Meghan and Harry did where she denies knowing her sister Samantha and claimed that they didn't grow up together. But Samantha said that that's not true. The two sisters had a good relationship and it ended, she claimed, after Meghan met Harry and cut off all communication. Samantha also points to a Netflix series where it was suggested that Samantha, along with others, began attacking Meghan on Twitter. That led to Samantha having her account suspended. Again, Samantha denies that she was part of an attack campaign against Meghan, and now she hopes this lawsuit will prove how Meghan tried to destroy her reputation. People change, they have agendas, they have other things influencing their lives. It doesn't change reality, Samantha Markle told Fox 13. The defence argues that Samantha's claims don't rise to the level of defamation. Megan's lawyer said Samantha is simply objecting to Megan's memory of a childhood growing up. 